Hey everybody, so I wanted to come on here and of course show my face. I wanna talk about like the secrets of skin prep when it comes to um, getting your skin ready to receive the makeup that you're gonna put on your face, okay? So, if you were wondering like, oh my God, she keeps talking about skin prep, uh, Skin prep is like the ground secret to a flawless, like one of the ground secrets to a flawless makeup application for yourself. And if you do makeup on other people, um, it's the same thing, all right? So if you don't, any, don't know anything about skin prep, this is the video for you. Step one, when it comes to putting on makeup and getting ready for makeup, your face has to be clean, so cleanliness, right? So your face has to be clean. Of course, any traces of makeup um, will basically dull the makeup that you're gonna put on your face. So let's say if you're using the right foundation shade, um, concealer shade, um, and all that, if you have traces of any makeup on your face, it can cause the skin to dull. And I'm doing this with fresh skin. Um, no makeup is on my face, so it kinda matches the video. But anyway, you wanna make sure there isn't any makeup on the face. A couple things you can use, micellar water and wipes. Uh, you can do it like that. You can give it to your clients and they can take it off. Um, and then you have to make sure that you're hitting everywhere you see skin, around your mouth, um, your lashes, your eyebrows. Typically, when clients come to me, they have makeup, um, mascara on their eyelashes or eyeliner that they didn't see or that they thought they got, um, or uh, like old traces of lip, lip liner or lipstick around their mouth. So you do have to make sure everything is off to make sure the tools that you are using are clean, are clean and sanitized, okay? Because again, if they are not clean, it spills up of makeup and spills up of makeup with more makeup causes dullness to the face and also it's, it's insanitary. So you wanna make sure that you are putting clean tools and working with a clean face. So, um, to prep for my skin, so I use, um, let not thou, this is not the right tag, but let not thou cleansing milk. And um, this is big. <laughs> this is a big size, this is like an eight ounce. But um, I love to use this. I also give it to my clients if they are not allergic to any of the ingredients that are inside this product. I give it to them and I send them off to go wash their face. It's just easier that way. Um, it lets me know that their face is clean, etc., etc. So anyway, so step two, 